everybody, I'm back and better than before. Thanks for watching my video, but it's not over yet, so please watch it. But if you don't, it's okay. I'm not a big complainer. I guess I'm a bit dramatic when I want to be. Anyhow, so I changed my channel's prerogative from parrots to poodles because um, I can't get a parrot because I can't take care of one. And I have one Australian Labradoodle, a Moyen Poodle, and I'm getting a third one, except it'll be my brother's. So please be sure to watch till the end of the video. Thank you again for watching. Teach them to ring a doorbell. This is really, really, really good. Because if you, they ring it, hey, ring it, ring it, Harry. Um, it means that they want to go potty. And if they are like Lou, when he's not in a cone, and they start asking to go outside all the time, then the fix is extra easy. You just untatch the doorbell from the door, like this, right, you see? And then you put it in storage. But I'm gonna put it back now because the dogs actually use this. If you are lucky on a rub poodle, or any dog really, be sure to let them win occasionally when playing games because that way they feel the urge to play again because if they lose every time, they'll lose self-confidence, just like humans and parents and lots of other animals. Interesting, humans have lots of traits that they share with other animals, but I guess that was a bit off topic, but only a little bit. Respect their space. If your dog starts grumbling or something, that means that you probably should stop doing what you're doing because they might end up biting you or um, sabotaging your guys' relationship together, which wouldn't be very good. Also, if they start wanting to cuddle, then that's a good thing. Just give them extra snuggles and scritches. Good boy, Lou. Good, good baby. Poodles are very intelligent dogs. In fact, the poodle is the second smartest dog breed in the world, meaning that you can teach them lots of cool tricks, like opening doors, massaging your head, and um, maybe bringing you a snack, yeah. Maybe you could open a Poodle Run Rotini bar. I'm sure that'd be a hit with coronavirus. After all, they're not carriers. They might look like pieces of artwork on top of your bed, but that doesn't mean that it's good for them. Fur, they might not establish dominance over you, which is a bad thing, especially with heavy dogs like Harry. So, you have to take them off, even though they're very, very, very cute on the bed right now. Thanks for watching my video. I hope that you can subscribe, but if you don't, it's not the end of the world. But if you do, then that's good. Anyhow, I'll come up with new videos probably once a week. I'm sorry I took a long break. I just got really lazy, and I had a midlife crisis when it came to parrots. They're very, very interesting creatures. Anyhow, remember to like and subscribe, but if you don't like and you unlike instead, it's okay. I've got a big ego for that reason.